Alright, hey, so welcome to the next part of the Final Fantasy X HD Remaster. Platinum walkthrough, or just a walkthrough, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so we left off, uh, we took a nap, I believe, in Waka's hut, tent, whatever you want to call it. And, uh, now I'm going to go ahead and, uh, enter this temple here. Sha Temple. Let's go ahead and enter the temple. Because, uh, yeah, we have to, and we can, and record like that, so, you know. Let's see what he has to say. Is something wrong? The summoner hasn't returned from the trial. Eh? Well, apprentice summoner, really. Huh? There's a room in there called the Cloister of Trials. Beyond is where the apprentice summoner prays. If the prayer is heard, the apprentice becomes a fully fledged summoner. Remember? Uh, so someone is in there somewhere and they haven't come back out. Right, I got it. A day's already gone by. Is it particularly dangerous in there? Sometimes, yes. Why don't you go in and help? There's already guardians in there. Besides, it's forbidden. Hey, but what if something happens? What if the summoner dies? The precepts must be obeyed! Like I care! So, uh, Titus felt like a badass and decided Maybe. to go ahead. This wasn't such a good idea after all. Uh, Titus, luckily for you, I've played this game millions of times, so. Um. It, you know, it's not a good idea for you, but I, I kind of know what I'm doing, so. Yeah. Uh, now these things are called the Cloister of Trials, and there is quite a few of them in this game. They're kind of like a side meaning type game. Uh, some people say that I don't like them. I mean, I don't know. It's it's nothing too difficult really, and I think it's just a nice way to take away, you know, take a break from the actual game storyline and help you solve some of these puzzles. Uh, now these trials are actually very important because not only do you need to pass them, there is a a hidden treasure in every uh, cloister of trials. Um, that's really important. That you need to get in each one if you want to, you know, complete the whole game. Um, and you'll see why later on. So right here, you're gonna get a glyph sphere. Glyph spheres uh, are present in every cloister of trials. What you want to do is just put it in this door. And this door is gonna magically open. Now the funny thing is, you can only carry one sphere at a time. Because apparently, two hands. You know, is just, I guess two hands don't work, man. Two hands don't work, so. Gotta, if you want, go ahead and open this door right here. And uh, right here, you're gonna get a Besaid Sphere. Come on, there we go. Take it, thank you. And I removed the, removed the Besaid Sphere. And uh, you can put it in here. And now you are, technically you're done with this first trial, so yes, that was really easy, very quick. But, uh, obviously we want to get the Destruction Sphere. Um, destruction Spheres are the spheres that unlock the hidden treasure, so... Uh, we're not going to go ahead and finish this off quite yet, I believe. Do you go here? You do you? No, no, okay, no, that's where the... Okay, now I know what you need to do. Uh, now you're going to go back here, you want to take this sphere from the door. Now these, the first couple of ones, they're pretty simple. I believe the third, the third cloister of trials, is where it kind of starts to pick up as far as the difficulty of them go. Um, the first two are pretty simple. I mean, I, I basically memorized all of the, all of them except one, where I look at a guide every time because I just can't seem to uh, memorize it for some reason. So, uh, which is the last one. Um, but go ahead and put a destruction sphere in there. And uh, now that's gonna go ahead and uh, blow up this door somehow. It's, it's Final Fantasy, it doesn't need to make sense. And you're gonna walk over here. And there you go, that's it. This is the whole trials. You actually get a rod of wisdom in here for the character later on. Um, but yeah, we are done. So. Now you just need to... I always have problems with this. Push the pet. Thank you. <laughs> you just need to push the pedestal 
over here, and now we are done. That is it. Hey! What's gotten into you? Hey, it's okay. Only summoners, apprentice summoners, and their guardians can enter here. It's a tradition. Very important. So what about you? Me? I'm a guardian. A guardian? Whoa! Ah! Summoners go on a pilgrimage to pray at every temple in Spira. Guardians protect them. The guardian's in there now. One of them's got a sure fuse. And who knows what the other's thinking. Well, now that we come this far, might as well go all the way. Alright, we got another trophy, the right thing. What are you doing here? Didn't think we'd be able to handle it? No, it's, uh, it's just... See, I told you she gets mad easy. I is the summoner alright? <sighs> Who are you? Man, was I surprised. And here I was thinking summoners were all old geezers. All right, so right there we witnessed, witness, we witnessed, we witnessed uh, someone becoming a summoner. We witnessed uh, some interesting characters. I'm going to leave it at that. Uh, so let's go ahead and join everyone else outside. And uh, see exactly what all this summoning stuff is about. Hey, over here. What, what's this guy want? Oh, I can't come over there. Okay, that's fine. Stupid invisible wall. Let's come over here then. What? Uh, ah, ow! Wait till you see this. I can't see anything. Ready. Okay.
I had never seen anything like it in my life. Sure, it was a little scary, but still, I could feel a strange kind of gentleness coming from it. All right, so this is going to be our first Aeon of uh, Valifor, and she, she's all right. Not a too big of a fan of her. Uh, I'm going to just leave the name. I remember that night we talked for the first time. I didn't know it then, but after that night, everything changed for everyone, for me. Let me introduce you to the team. This guy here wants into the tournament so bad, I let him on the team. His memory's a little fuzzy, so don't mind him if he says anything odd. Come on, say hi. Uh, hi guys. Hi. So what's our goal? To do our best! Nope, we got a new goal now. Our new goal is victory! To win every match, defeat every opposing team, to bring the Crystal Cup back to our island. That's all we need to do to win. Easy, huh? Alright, so we uh, persuaded these guys now believe in victory and everything. And a uh, cool little fun fact that I never mentioned actually. Waka, um, if you guys know Futurama uh, Bender, uh, they have the same voice actor. So Waka and Bender are both played by the same voice actor. Which I thought was pretty cool. Uh, now let's go ahead uh, over here. You heathen! Stay, Stay away, away from, from the summoner! <laughs> Yuna, be careful. But it was really my fault to begin with. Oh. 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 I'm Yuna. Thank you so much for your help earlier. Huh? Uh, I'm sorry about that. Wasn't that... Wasn't I not supposed to... Guess I kind of overreacted. Oh, no. I was overconfident. Um, I saw that Aeon thing. That's amazing. Uh, really? Do you think I can become High Summoner? Lady Yuna, come play with me some more. So, tomorrow then. Tomorrow? We're going on the same boat, aren't we? Oh, really? We can talk more. Huh. You can tell me all about Xanarkand. She's cute, yeah? Don't get no ideas. No promises there, big guy. Hey, but what if she, like, comes on to me? That's not going to happen. If you get tired, let me know. I had a bed made for you. Alright, so you could definitely uh, see that uh, Titus and... Oh, I want to say Titus so bad. And you and, uh, you don't have like this, you know, sort of already connection going on. And oh my god, I love this line right here. Stay away from the summer... <laughs> Stay away... <laughs> Stay away from the summoner! Oh man, a anyone who's played this game loves to laugh and just do that. Uh, that's a, that's hilarious. But there's nothing really much else to do at this time right now. So, might as well talk to Waka and take his offer up. Uh, mm. Ready? Yes, Good. indeed. Sleep tight.
Where's that boat? Everyone will find us if it doesn't come soon. You really sure this is okay? Would you take me to Zanarkand? Hey! You said you'd go with me! No, oh, hey, I, uh... I thought Waka told you not to get any ideas. He did? Yeah. Yeah, so you're coming with me. Hey, stop dreaming! You with a woman? You can't even catch a ball! Oh, what's the matter? Gonna cry again? Cry, cry. That's the only thing you're good for. I hate you. Huh? What'd you say? You have to speak loudly. I hate you! Huh? That's the spirit. You can do it. I hate you! He's dead, okay? Dead. He does look a lot like Chapu. I was surprised, too, the first time I saw him. But no matter what he looks like, he isn't Chapu. You shouldn't have brought him here in the first place. Yeah, but... He needed our help. Excuses again? Yeah, but... That's it. No more. Enough, Waka. So, who's Chapu? My little brother, Chapu. He looked like you. He's dead? He was with the Crusaders when they fought Sin last year. He didn't make it. I first heard on the day of the tournament. Oh, so that's why. I became a guardian to fight Sin, yeah? Revenge, then? That was the idea. <laughs> I'm more worried about a stupid game now than avenging my brother. Well, after the next tournament, I'll be a guardian full-time. I know it kind of looks like I'm using you, but I'm not. Don't worry. I mean, I owe you a lot. You really helped me out, you know? What I mean is... Thanks, Waka. <laughs> Stop. You're embarrassing me. So that was a really interesting... Uh night <laughs> learned a lot of things you know the summoners you know waka chapu and his brother all that good stuff so i think i'm gonna save it here and we're gonna call it a video because we're about 20 minutes in so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you on the next part